Welcome back to LearnWire. We're going to be looking at Kateb, and it's an AI uh, copywriting uh, tool. Uh, you know, I've done a lot of these, probably the most popular type of softwares that I do like to review on this channel. And I really like to find which ones that are going to be, uh, you know, kind of hidden gems or the ones that are just the best and have good pricing and all that stuff. So you can come in here and I found this one on AppSumo. It's uh, $29. So it's, um, it's less than your typical product, which starts at 39, um, between 39 and 59 is a normal price, uh, for a lifetime deal on AppSumo. This one's a little under, so it's at 29. It does have five, uh, five star reviews, which is good. And I went and read the reviews and people do like the tool. It does have some things that it needs to improve on. Uh, but we're going to go and check this tool out and just kind of compare it. Now I already have went in, uh, in this one, in this particular one, I've gone in and wrote an article and checked out the software. So I'm starting to formalize my opinion, um, as I make the video. Um, so actually I need to touch auto suggested. I didn't see where that was. So we'll go and check and see how we can maybe get that to work. We won't have access to the proofreading. There is a copy scape and, um, proof, well, not copy scape the tool, but there's a duplicate content checker and a proofreading a checker built in. I don't have access to that because I'm on the free version. Uh, we're going to go check it out uh, right now. So let's go jump in. So we're in here inside the dashboard. Now, I don't know if they have an actual affiliate program or not, but you do when you sign up, you can refer people directly to the website. And if they sign up to a monthly plan, then you get points and these points, um, uh, can be um, contributed to more words, more free words for you. Now, uh, it is important before I move forward to say that this $29 deal, it's much like the writer uh, lifetime deal where it's not, there's not a lot of content that they're giving you per month. And if you're really serious about writing uh, blog posts on a daily basis, long form content, you would need to pick up the, pick up a, um, monthly plan from them, right? Because if we come down here, you're going to get 15,000 words per month on this plan, right? So, you know, that's about seven, uh, long form articles. Um, and by the time you maybe delete some of the AI that it's writing, that's, you know, doesn't, doesn't make sense. I would say that it's actually probably more like five really good articles. Um, and so, and still even paying somebody for five articles would cost way more than $29. So it's still worth it to pick it up. I just wanted to let you guys know that you would have to get an unlimited type plan. They do have a lot of members. Um, this isn't updated. They have about 12,000, uh, members right now using the tool. So that's great. Um, they have a plagiarism checker, proofreading, um, automatic article rewriter and an automatic AI writer as well. Cool stuff. This reviewer. From a plus member, um, does throw in there that you do, uh, need, uh, they have a $30 per month unlimited plan when you, um, and that's, if you have the lifetime deal, you're able to sign up and that's exact, that's almost the exact pricing that writer has and everything. So, um, it makes sense that I would be comparing this apples to apples. We're going to be comparing this to writer. I mean, I'm not going to actually jump into writer, but I am going to just kind of look at this from, um, a writer customer lens, if that makes sense. So we're back into the tool. Now you can see the different tools they have right here. Okay. And there's the latest activities. I did a couple things over here. They do have a roadmap, um, as well. You can look at what they've um, added in. Let's see where that's at. So I'm going to say homepage. And I saw that roadmap, um, earlier. Oh yeah. Right here. So right here, there's a roadmap. We can click on that. It's going to take us over here and you can see what's um, in progress right now. Export content straight into WordPress. That's awesome. Um, plagiarism checker and content proofreading. Those two are both live. Really cool. And then what they're working on is creating AI content using a mobile app and paraphrase any internet text with a browser extension. So, um, I like how they have the roadmap built in. Um, I think that more, uh, developers and uh, websites need to just have a, a button that says roadmap. So you're just, people don't have to go hunt for the link or anything like that. It just literally is right here posted on their website, which is really cool. Or they should at least have a link up here when you click on it, then it takes you to wherever the roadmap is. And a lot of times they use Trello. Mm -hmm. So we're going to go back over to the home page and let's just write something real quick. So um, I'm going to start off with the AI writer right here and just click on it. <clears throat> 
you can do variations right here. Okay, so I'm gonna do two variations and see what ends up happening on this one. Last time I tested, I did just one, but I don't wanna take up all my credits as well. Um, I'm gonna go over here into um, rank um, IQ and just grab an article, how to make money with selling anything. Nope, um, let's see here, how to make money as a single mom. Okay, well, let's just grab that one right there. And that's what we're going to test. I'm gonna come back in here. I'm going to write that in as the brief and then I'm also going to put that in as the title. Okay. I'm going to put my cursor here and then right here, I think you really just push generate. So I'm going to push the generate button right here and it's going to go out there. It says it's writing content for us. Okay. So it gave us two paragraphs, two variations. So imagine if you, you know, you could go all the way up to 10 variations. And you can just see, um, it is much easier to make money as a single mom today than it, um, it was in the past day. Uh, many women are making and earning their income, their own income. Unfortunately, single mothers can have trouble making enough money to support themselves and their children. If you have a little or no income coming in, there are uh, some steps that you can take to increase your overall f uh, financial situation below. You will find five ideas. Okay. So there's another one over here. We're just going to go with the, the, the first one. So I'm going to grab that and push the delete button. Okay. So now I'm just going to put my cursor over here and I believe we can just um, come over here. I'm going to change it, make sure to change it back to variation one. Now this is uh, this interface right here is a, a simulator writer. Okay. I actually don't know what tool came out first. Um, I know that this tool has been out for a while. This is not a brand new launch. Um, it is on AppSumo, but it, it didn't just come out. Um, and so when we look over here, you can see you can come in here and use any of the tools in here, right? You can grab any of these tools on this long form editor, which is cool. It's very, that's very similar to writer. You can choose variations and you can choose uh, language. Look at all the different languages um, it will write in. That's super um, awesome. And you get a word count right here. So it is a very basic uh, user interface, but it is nice and clean and everything makes sense, right? And I like, uh, I like the, the main, main things um, all have different colors, right? Plagiarism checker. When you're done writing, you can click that and see how unique your content is. Um, I use Copyscape, but, um, if you have uh, the lifetime deal, you're going to get access to these tools. So you may as well use them. Um, then you have proofreading and then you have, you can copy the article and, uh, you can bold and you can change font size. You can add H2 tags in here and you can build out your whole blog article in here, which is super cool. Um, and then you can also change the content brief in here as you write. But, um, what I want to see is just when I write generate uh, what it's going to, if it's going to continue just writing an article for us. Okay. <clears throat> Being a single mom means that you have to work harder than most people, but it doesn't mean that you can't earn. So I'm going to click it one more time. And this is where I'm kind of like, I don't know how else to have it specifically write about something. If you're going to be, so like right here, if you're going to be a single mom and you have no, so it just keeps writing intro paragraphs right here. Okay. So I don't really know what to do next because if I highlight the text, there's plagiarism checker, proofreading, there's paraphrase and there's enrich or complete. So if I take just like maybe one sentence right here, enrich and complete, I'm going to click that and see what ends up happening. Does it just keep writing? Uh, no. And it even kind of stopped right there. So one thing that's kind of, you know, I'm, I'm just not seeing where you're able to highlight text and then say, write, continue writing, right? How do you continue writing this? Um, not really seeing the button for that. And when I click generate, it continues to just kind of keep, seems like it's continuing to write intro paragraphs. So that part I'm a little confused about now. If we came in here to blog outline, maybe, right? And then we come back over here to our uh, title or keyword and put that in here. I'm going to go ahead and grab that, put my cursor over here and push generate. Let's see what ends up happening here. Okay, so that is the outline that it chose to come up. Oh, well, so it gave us, okay, that's, that's part of it is that we did one variation. So let's do three variations this time and click it one more time. So you got to kind of get to, to know the tool. <clears throat> okay. So then now it's given us tips for making money as a single mom. And then it did give us a little bit of a sentence between, um, underneath each one. Right. But I'm not seeing where if I wanted to write on this one, let's just see what ends up happening right here. Um, we, we would have to switch it back. I would imagine, or let's go to blog intro. 
the topic. Um, so if we put the topic in here, I'm going to just, just kind of testing it, testing out how we can get the best outputs of, in the software, right? So I'm going to put my cursor over here. Actually, I'm just going to push return and then I'm going to say generate. Let's see where it writes. Or does it write on the bottom? Okay, so we're getting kind of like a timeout error right there. Not really sure what that is all about. Not sure if we're getting a timeout because we're on a trial. Again, that would be not, that would not be good because if you do this sort of thing for a free trial um, test, then do you think that the person's going to sign up for the software? No. So I'm hoping that this is just kind of an error. We will try again here in a second. Okay, so I'm going to try that one more time to try to write a blog intro based on there are a number of ways to make money as a single mom. And I'm going to push generate. When you're a single mom, it can be hard to play, pay the bills. However, okay, so it's doing a decent job, but it just seems to not be coming up with new ideas. There's just a lot of them just seem like intro paragraphs. I know that's an intro paragraph, but it should be taking into context um, what we're what we're trying to write about. So. For me uh, personally so far with the long form editor, uh, there's a little confusion on just how to use the tool. It should be very self-explanatory. It should, uh, you should be able to continue writing an article uh, one by one or select specifically like writer, select specifically what you want it to write about and then say, continue to write. Now enhance or complete does not seem to do that for me. Let's, I'm gonna try it one more time with this. Tips for making money as a single mom. Um, it just bolded that whole thing. So um, <clears throat> long form editor, it definitely uh, needs a little work and it's not, um, you know, in, in my opinion, it's not better than writer um, at this point. Um, so we're going to go up and let's see, there's some other things that you can go through here. There is a summarizer. You can get email um, subject lines. Um, we can look at the paraphraser tool as well. Now you can also come over here at any time and go skip to anything because they don't, they have a short list, short enough list of tools where they're able to actually put everything out uh, right here on their main menu, which is uh, nice that there's simplicity as well. So I'm going to come through here. Let's just go to the paraphrasing section and we'll just come through here and come back into, um, now you can come over here and fetch article, um, or you can come through and um, just grab. So what we're going to do is I'm just going to paraphrase something over here. So we're going to copy this, come back in over here. I'm going to throw this in paste as text, get rid of that design article. We want to summarize this. So I'm just going to say paraphrase. Now you can select over here, basic rewriting or advanced rewriting. We'll go basic rewriting and paraphrase, or maybe I, I do have to put test two. You have to put a title in and then push paraphrase. So it's going to go out there and you can see the timeline down here. It's going to paraphrase and it's done rewriting that. So it took this entire chunk of text and it paraphrased it. You can buy all kinds of products, clothing, car parts, food, and other items on the internet these days. You can even order them online. So it took that entire thing and it just made it into like two short sentences. Um, you know, you, you can be the judge um, on if, you, if it's good or not. Um, let's go through and I actually wanted to test that. Um, I want to test out the image thing because I'm not seeing, so come back into history. Okay. How to make, um, money as a single mom and where, because they advertise that it will go out and find images for us, but I'm not seeing where it is going to find the image for us. Is that a premium feature that's only available in the pre premium plan, but you would, you would want to sample this out, right? So I'm going to go back over here real quick. There's supposed to be a section where you can come in here. Look, making your articles visually appealing. There should be, oh, I, I think I, oh, let me try something out. If we come back in here, there's, should be a, if I push return. Okay. So this plus comes up. This is where we can say, add an image. And no, it's just saying add an image from, so that's not what we're looking for. So there's video and there's just a line right there. So that is not going to work because for image, it's just inserting an image on your computer. I'm not seeing where it's, it's, um, going out and getting an image for us, right? Like it said that it was going to, so I'm not sure if that's a premium feature or what, but, um, there's not an option right here either. So. We can come over here and just see if this is a feature over here. Promotional ideas. 
and I'm not seeing add an image or anything. So there's some things that they're even advertising that it has an image, auto auto image feature, and I'm not seeing the auto image. If that was a big, big enough part of their software to put in a slide on AppSumo, but then I'm not seeing it over here, right? Um, I don't know what copy means. I'm just gonna push it. That just copies the entire text. Yeah, so I'm not seeing anything about the image. So um, that's going to conclude this review. Um, I just wanted to get this out there for you guys or anybody else that's going to come and check this tool out. Um, you know, it's not it's not a bad tool, um, but it's not. It definitely has some work to do um, before they could get up there and actually compete with uh, software like Writer uh, or Jarvis or something like that. And it's definitely not there. Um, and I'm just going to have to conclude the, and conclude this review by. Just saying that this software is just not quite there yet. Um, it does have a good price point, only $29, but I'm not seeing how I could actually come in here and write articles uh, very um, quickly. Um, I feel a little confused using the software, and you guys know I do a lot of reviews, and I've seen a lot of these AI writers, and some are better than others. And this one is just not in that bucket where I would, you know, quite recommend yet. I will leave a link below in case you want to go and look at it or check it out or pick it up for 29 bucks. But um, this is definitely not like a top recommendation for you, if that makes sense. So I hope you enjoyed this review. And if you did, please hit that like button and make sure to subscribe so you get more honest reviews just like this. Until next time, take care.